I attempted to route my Moto Edge 40 using Kernel SU, but unfortunately I flashed the wrong kernel image, which caused my device to get stuck in a boot loop, and now it keeps rebooting repeatedly. To fix this, I'll show you how to flash the official firmware and bring your device back to life. Step 1. Booting into fast boot mode. If your device is in a boot loop like mine, you'll need to boot it into fast boot mode. To do this, press and hold the volume down and power button simultaneously. This will take you to fast boot mode. Once in fast boot mode, connect your phone to your PC using a USB cable. Now let's move to the computer screen. With your phone connected in fast boot mode, the first thing you need to do is download ADB and fast boot drivers for your device. After installing the drivers, download and install the Rescue and Smart Assistant tool from Lenovo's official website. All the download links provided in the video description. Once the drivers are installed and your phone is connected, open the Rescue tool. The tool will automatically detect your phone. As you can see, my phone has been detected in the tool under the Rescue tab. This tab displays all the details of your device. Now click on the download button to start downloading the firmware. The download duration depends on your internet speed. Once the download is complete, the tool will automatically extract the firmware files. After the extraction is complete, the download button will change to a rescue button. Click on it to begin the flashing process. Follow the on-screen instructions to proceed. It will start the firmware flashing process while flashing your phone, keep in mind. Always use a high quality and authentic USB cable. Avoid using your phone or computer during the flashing process as it may cause interruptions. The flashing process will take some time. Once it's complete, your phone will reboot automatically. Flashing is complete. Now you can unplug your device. As the first boot after flashing may take a bit longer than usual. While your phone is booting up, I have something to share with you. My phone's bootloader was unlocked during this process. However, I searched on the internet. This method should also work on devices with a locked bootloader. Try this flashing process on your phone and let us know in the comments if it works for you. Also, mention whether your bootloader is locked or unlocked, as this information can help others flash their phones successfully. And if you want to unlock the bootloader or root your Motorola phone, check out the video linked in the description. And that's it. My Moto Edge 40 is now back to life, working like new. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more content like this.